Delegate Ebersole. Thank you. Thank you, Madam Chair. So um, I, one of the reasons that we're, we're extending a little bit is because we're concerned about funding and we're not entirely Absolutely. sure. I wonder if you have uh, made a recommendation for a set aside this year so that we can get full information implementation going in FY21. Right. Yeah, actually, um, if I understand your uh, uh, question correctly, the General Assembly did um, set aside some money last year to jumpstart the recommendations in uh, Fiscal 20. 200, right? Uh, I think it was two. Uh, I think there was a 200 million. Uh, but uh, let Rachel um, correct me no, if I'm wrong. Wasn't actually, I, I do understand. That was actually my question. My question is going forward. Are you making a recommendation? Yes. We recommend that you uh, um, uh, reserve uh, uh, 750 million for fiscal 21, which would be the state year share of the of the first year of the full implementation. And, and who would and the other share would be equal to or well the, the, the funding uh, in Maryland is roughly 50 50 yes, between okay. the state and the and the uh, and, and, and the local jurisdiction so the first year cost is uh, 150 uh, 1.5 billion so the the 750 would be half of that and you feel like even in that we, since we don't have the, the funding form is nailed down exactly yet um, that that will be a, sufficient to keep it on track right. Okay, thank you. Yes. 